What's up everyone, Danny Lightning back with another CSR2 video. So the new Elite Tuners event, Izzy's Tuner Pit is up on the map with the McLaren 720S. So we're going to find out if the car is free. We're going to check out some of the body kits, how, how to do this, how to do that. Then we're going to go look at the event and give you my thoughts and opinions and info on the event itself. So this will be a quick little overview. So let's get to it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and let's see if it's going to be free. All right, so here is Izzy, blah, blah, blah. We got a McLaren 720S, cool, cool. So let's click on some thingy dingies here that I do not want to read because I am too lazy. <laughs> and it says go race. So let's do the first couple of races. We'll give you my whole take and opinion on this stuff in just a minute. So yeah, let's see what, what happens with this. So here's the McLaren. Three, two, one, go. All right. I think we got him. I think we got him. So what I assume is going to happen is we're going to do the first couple of races and then it's going to be like, bam, here is a free car. Now, if you haven't already started the Elite Tuners event, you're probably not going to see this. But anybody who's, you know, got through most of them, this will pop up on your map eventually as you're doing the Elite Tuners events. I guess that's the best way to put it. So let's go back out to the map. We did one race and... Okay, here comes Izzy again. So I guess we got to go do another race. I don't like these speech bubbles. Honestly, I'm here to play a game, not read a book. But three, two, one, go. Second nitrous, third gear, fourth gear, fifth gear. And of course, you know, in order to finish this thing, you're gonna, you're gonna need to get this car up to purple stars. And they're probably going to give you so many days to finish the entire event. So that's one thing you got to think about. If you're going to finish this, you're going to need a bunch of tokens. You're going to need all the elite tokens, guys. You're probably going to have to have, I don't know, different races will require a different amount of stars. So they don't make these things easy. All right, that was close. Blah, blah, blah. Go race again. So we're going to go ahead and do one last race here. Now I'm assuming after this one, we're either gonna get the car for free or we're gonna have to buy it. I don't know, we're gonna find out. Now when you do this, I don't, can't guarantee it's gonna be free or paid. You know, by the time you do this, if you're not doing it right when it comes out, there's a chance that things could be different, but this is, this is, this is how it is. If I could speak today, that would be wonderful. This is how it is right now, according to the very start of the event, so. All right, I just won the McLaren 720S. I'm getting that car for free, and I'm pretty sure you will too. I'm pretty sure you'll get that for free as well. And I'll be working for a sh working on a shift pattern for this car here pretty soon. But in order to get all the body kits and all the cool stuff, you're gonna need to go run all these races, put all your tokens into it. So I can guarantee you, I don't have enough pink tokens to max this car out. I can probably get it close if I want to, but I'm going to find out if this is a good car. I don't know. Oh, come on now, Jess. I see that. I I'm looking at it, Jess. Get off of my back, Jess. You're almost as bad as Donna now, Jess. So if you want to max this car out with the elite tokens, this is the deal. You're going to need these. Okay, so about 30,000 green, 10,000 blue, 4,000 pink, and 200 gold is about what you need to max out one of these cars. So this car would need to be really, really, really good before I really throw all those tokens into it because there's going to be more of these events coming out sometime soon i would assume i'm doing a little bit of research and a little bit of playing around with this car right now and it seems like it's actually going to be a pretty decent car i will have a video coming up pretty soon on how to drive this car in stage five stage six live racing setup review and the whole shebang but overall i think it's going to end up being a pretty cool car highly customizable so let's go look at the races and all that good stuff really quick so there's going to be a total of 60 races. So in order to unlock all the body kits and the bells and whistles and the cool parts, you're going to have to run through these races and you're going to have to upgrade the car's elite levels. Both of those will unlock different body kits and stuff. It's kind of a weird deal how they have that set up, but that is how that's going to work. You're going to get a lot of elite tokens, keys, basic parts, stage six parts, all kinds of little stuff when you run this event. So is it going to be worth running this event? That's always kind of the loaded question with these events. Come on, Jerry, get off my screen, man. I'm trying to make a video. But the problem is with 
this is you're gonna have to have all those elite tokens to max this thing out to be able to finish the event you've basically got what 60 days two months you have two months roughly to finish this and then it disappears from your map and it'll be gone forever so you have two months to get all of those tokens so I dumped a couple parts into this car, a couple of tokens, and I put on the second body kit. Didn't have to run any races or anything. Um, yeah, those are just some basic upgrades right there, but seems like a pretty decent car overall. I'm pretty sure it's going to have a live racing setup. Somebody's going to need to really get it out there and test it, but we will have a video coming up for this car here in a couple of days on how to drive it and all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, it seems like a really cool car overall so far. I'm liking what I'm seeing. So yeah, if you're into the Elite Tuner stuff, you want to upgrade this thing, go for it. Just remember, you got two months to do this before the event disappears. At race 49, it shows that you have to have all purple stars. So yeah, you can make it up to race 49 until you have purple stars. At race number 40, 37, you're going to have to have five golden stars. So Every so many races, there is going to be a star increase upgrade limit or whatever the heck you want to call it. I don't know how to say that, but you guys get what I'm saying, don't you? I definitely hope so because I don't. Or do I? Maybe I do. I don't know, but yeah, that's how it goes. <laughs> All right, so I think that's our overview on this event. I see this is Hoonigan event up on the map. I'll have a video coming out for that and some other stuff and a video on how to drive this car coming out very soon. So stay tuned for all that stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are amazing. I do my best to make content to help you guys out, keep you informed, show you what's going on with all this stuff. So don't forget to like and subscribe and maybe consider a channel membership. They start at just a couple of bucks and they help the channel out big time. Everybody who watches these videos, hangs out with me on the live streams and everything else. Thank you guys so much. Giant shout out to my channel members. If you drop down the video's description, you'll see my other YouTube channels, my Discord server, some really important game news, some links to get some really cool lighting, cameras, video gear, audio gear, all kinds of good stuff like that. So if you drop down the video's description, you'll find lots of awesome stuff down there. And yeah, I think that's going to wrap this one up. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys are amazing. Lightning out. See ya.